Some big changes may be coming to your gas tank, but also it could mean higher prices at the grocery store. Bowing to pressure from the oil industry, the Environmental Protection Agency is proposing a sharp reduction in the amount of ethanol, which is mostly made from corn, in the nation's fuel supply. Jackie DeAngelis has more on what that could mean to energy companies, corn farmers, and consumers. The EPA proposing for the first time today to ease and lessen the requirements for ethanol in gasoline. This is quite significant because the agency for the first time acknowledging the fact that this mandate requirement set in 2007 may be difficult or potentially impossible to meet. The EPA asking refiners to blend 15 billion gallons of renewable fuel into U.S. gas supplies. That's roughly 16 percent less than what Congress's 2007 renewable fuels law requires. The impact of this on the the markets well corn futures were immediately lower on the news that's because ethanol comes from corn and this proposal would reduce corn demand in addition the refiners spiking on this because it brings their costs down and finally if it's cheaper for the refiners it means it's cheaper at the pump and thus gasoline futures also seeing a decline some other implications to consider here ethanol demand is dropping off a bit because of the recent surge in domestic oil and gas supplies in addition demand for transportation fuel also dropping that that makes ethanol less appealing. Finally, using corn and ethanol makes the corn price more expensive. This, of course, makes it tough for those ranchers out there who use corn to feed their animals. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Jackie DeAngelis.